going on everybody crazy dog back for another video so yesterday was the Indians home opener and the Indians came out with the win in extra innings against Chicago no not the Cubs the White Sox but uh seemed oddly familiar right yeah except there was no rain delay either so uh that's the unfamiliar part about it. No rain between uh, the ninth and the tenth inning. <laughs> but um, yeah, the Indians actually won this time against Chicago. Although it was the White Sox this time. But still, you know. So we've beaten another Central Division opponent. I honestly think the Indians are going to dominate the Central this year. Legit. We're not going to have any competition when it comes to the Central. We're going to dominate the division. Hands down. Now, looking at the game yesterday, it really wasn't that great of a game. You know, I feel like high-scoring affairs, but it was a, a defensive slugfest. It was a great pitching matchup, too. So, uh, it was Carrasco versus James Shields. And Carrasco really uh, did his thing. He was dealing that yesterday. And he went seven innings, seven strikeouts, Four hits, one run, which was a dinger given to given up to Todd Frazier. So uh, that's pretty impressive, though. You know, with the way our pitching hasn't has been so far this year, we have a knack for giving up uh, clown car innings, which is when you give up a crap ton of runs in a short amount of time. You know, when you can't get out of an inning, it takes a lot out of your team. But Carrasco's really been uh, diamond it. You know, he's he's been looking really impressive in his first two starts. So uh, the Indians got started with a bang. Second batter into the inning. Uh, Francisco Lindor went yard for his fourth home run of the year already through seven games. It's insane, right? And it would remain one nothing until the top of the fifth when Todd Frazier went yard off of Carrasco. And it would remain tied until the tenth inning. Although the Indians had multiple chances to really blow the doors off the White Sox. Including not one, but two bases loaded situations with none other than Edwin Encarnacion at the plate. And what did he do both times? He hit into double plays. He has to work on that. But uh, I feel like next time he's encountered with that situation, he's going to send it out. He's going to send it out of the park. And he'll be strutting around with his arm hanging out. Doing the Ed Wing. But yeah, uh, Indians got the win. They improved to 4-3. and three. Today they're looking to go 5-3. and three. Uh, First pitch is at 6-10. Salazar on the mound. Let's go, Tribe. I'm going to get back to watching this game. I know it's a lot late for yesterday's review, but, uh, hey, why not? <laughs> you know? So, hopefully, the Indians can uh, continue their dominance of the Central. So, uh, I'm going to end this video now so I can get back to watching this game. Wolf Tribe. I'm Crazy Dog 99 Oh, and by the way, go Jackets. Beat Pittsburgh. Hmm. <laughs> I'm out.